So this is a story about a man who was like, you know what? I'm going to try to go and assault this woman over here. Okay. And she was like, yeah, we ain't doing that today. <laughs> and she went and fought the F back like Jesse Smollett. Okay. But no, seriously, um, we have a story of a man who tried to assault a woman and she went and fought back, you know, saved her own life. Cause this fool seemed like he was going to kill her possibly we are going to get into it but before we do so do not forget to one leave a comment down below also like subscribe and hit the thanks button as well now let's get into it man who tried to assault woman at fort worth apartment complex stabbed okay a halton city man is facing multiple charges after a fight with the woman in fort worth ended in him getting stabbed Fort Worth police were called to the loss at West 7th Street Apartments on Crockett Street at 11.43 p.m. on Crema. When officers made their way into the apartment, they saw 19-year-old Gavin Norris, who had been stabbed in the stomach. Investigators say that Norris had gotten into a verbal fight with a female. He attempted to assault the woman, who, obviously she's fearing for her life, grabbed a knife and stabbed him. The woman was able to get out of the apartment and called the police. Norris was treated at the hospital for non-life-threatening injuries. He has been charged with unlawful restraint, assault causing bodily injury, resisting arrest, and aggravated assault against a public servant. Now, when this story, when I was looking at it, I was like, hmm, I have some thoughts. So I went to the comment section. Y'all, people are ruthless. <laughs> so so was the 19-year-old... <laughs> So it's a 19 year old Stewie Griffin because I was looking at the image and I was like, oh, uh, okay. Another one. Don't attack people if you are not prepared to deal with the consequences of them defending themselves. One, you shouldn't be attacking people at all. You know, obviously that's, you know, that's a given. This is when you do any of this. When you rob someone, when you, you know, try to beat somebody up, whether it's a fight or whatever the case may be, you have to be prepared because you don't know who this person is most of the time you have to be prepared for whatever you have coming to you but i got one more comment that someone made i'm going to make kinder remarks about the 19 year old looks than most he needs a makeover weight loss and some and training on how to behave and properly treat a woman he obviously was not properly trained by his parents as generational folks and that's also another thing of course you know it's all you know bad parenting at the end of the day why is your 19 year old automatically like okay we got a dispute i'm ready to swing you know why are we why are we doing all this you know i don't it doesn't make any sense to me why why is it just like we have an altercation we have a disagreement let me go and beat you up let me go and assault you let me go and insert cause bodily harm to you why is it that th we always just jump to that as opposed to well let's figure out what's going on you know, then you have people be like, oh, man, but but they shouldn't have killed this person. And they should. Well, I mean, when you're being an aggressor, I don't know what you expect to happen. If you're being an aggressor and I'm fearful of my life and you end up dying or getting seriously injured in the process, paralyzed, whatever the case may be. How was that this person's fault? You know what I mean? So it's like, ah, that's how I feel about it. But let me know what you all think about this story down below.